The whole business, the whole, the whole concept of an aid transition period, which keeps us um, uh, tied to the EU, at least in the sort of negotiating framework, uh, given the way the EU behave and given how craven we are uh, relative to, I think, the real situation, which is that the EU has much more to lose from this than we do, um, uh, the transition period gives the, opens up the sort of almost indefinite possibility mm. of us being... Be, be, being being led into further further disadvantage. Um, I don't agree that uh, these deals, uh, whatever they are, are so difficult. I'm not minimising for a moment. There are going to be there would be difficulties. Mm. You cannot have a momentous disengagement of Britain coming out of the EU without serious problems and disadvantages and complications. I fully accept that. But nevertheless, we all are being told that, you know, there are these terrible disadvantages to us, but no one ever talks about the uh, pain that the EU countries would face if they went down the path of punishing us. In other words, it is in their interests to make deals with us, not the EU negotiators, the individual countries. And consequently, difficult as it will be, I think that there is every prospect that, you know, bilateral deals will be done without too much pain, but not if it's under the umbrella of an ongoing uh, fractious, uh, mm. manipulative but uh, but transition. Can, can I, can I, just, I need to point out that there are no bilateral... I mean, it's only you can only deal with the EU, you can't deal with the individual countries. And even then, I mean, the truth is, it's just under 10% of their exports go to us, and yeah. just under half of ours go to them. And so there's a basic quantitative problem of the fact that absolutely it's bad for them, it's just less bad for them than it is for us. Uh, what's less bad for them? They've only got 10% of their exports that come to the UK, mm, whereas we export just under half of ours to them. So obviously it's, it's a more punishing experience for us, just in terms of scale. Uh, I thought that the balance of trade was in our favour. They export more to us than we export to them. Yes, exactly, well, yeah. But isn't that the opposite of what you mm. just said? No, no, no. So, in terms of the amount, the actual sort of slice of their trade yes. that comes... It's a, as a proportion. Exactly, yeah. Yes. Oh. So you're both right. There oh. we go. That's lovely, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> that's not strictly true. But, yeah, anyway. <laughs>